Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Friday the 8th of November 2024. Third attempt here. Third attempt. I have got it wrong twice without pencil marks twice. I was feeling smug the first time. I was feeling smugger the second time because I figured I'd done it differently. And each time I came to a, a, a problem and uh, without using pencil marks and so I'm going to put in pencil marks right from the beginning here because this game has foxed me twice very annoyingly I've even had I even went back and checked that I hadn't copied the digits incorrectly because I had um, I, I thought I, I don't understand it I don't know where I've gone wrong it doesn't seem to me that I've made a mistake I've obviously have made a mistake twice um, and so there we go uh, I'm going to put pencil marks in. Right, I'll say this for the third time, but um, <laughs> my 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 chat. I'm getting bored with saying this, but um, I, I'm saying I've said it twice. I'll say it a third time. It must be true if you say something three times, right? Uh, people are disaffected by the length of time they have to wait for justice. Um, why don't we have prisoner Trump instead of present president elect Trump? because it's taken too long to get him prosecuted yes i know evidence gathering takes a long time but still years and years and years they've had and he's been known for various things before i mean actually he should have been investigated while he was still president but anyway um what else uh yes uh in the uk grant the grenfell tower disaster the inquiry the inquiry is still ongoing i think isn't it for that years and years and years later and i mention it because another inquiry is currently taking place uh, in the uk about um the death of dawn sturgis she died in 2018 of novichok poisoning ah once i mentioned the name the name novichok suddenly memories come back i guess uh, you remember the two Russians who were interested in church architecture, apparently, <laughs> and were very interested in Salisbury Cathedral, nobody had ever heard of before, but apparently they loved it. And it's very famous in Russia, and so they amazingly went off to become tourists in Salisbury, look at the architecture, and accidentally put Novichok, Novichok sorry, a poison on on um, Skripo, I think he's like Sergei Skripo, former Russian spy. Anyway, Don Sturgis died. Uh, the evidence is still, the inquiry, sorry, is still taking place now. As I say, that was in 2018, and we are now just about to complete 2024. Uh, why, 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 the general public will ask, does it take so many years? Is it just because they want to push stuff out of the public's eye and away from our goldfish? bowl attention span and if you don't believe people have a goldfish bowl attention span Trump was in office only four years ago and a lot of people seem to have forgotten what he did when he was there last time all right now let's get on with this game now I'm going to show you how I began last time and this time I'm going to I'm going to have to do it with pen no I'm going to put pencil marks in right from the get-go because I've messed it up twice I must be making a mistake fatal mistake somewhere so I'm going to put pencil marks in right from the beginning as I say, I got like half the way through twice without pencil marks, and clearly it was not correct. So I'm going to play safe. I'm going to put in these pencil marks and uh, erase them later as and when necessary. I have no idea where I went wrong. It's so frustrating, though. Really been annoying because I was quite feeling quite smug quite pleased with myself I was thinking oh I worked that out that was very good and clearly it wasn't there we are never feel smug it's a horrible kind of emotion really By the way, I worked out that these were one and a one and six pair. That's my, that's my contribution to smugness. Six blocks across there, we'll get six there. We have six in these squares here. Uh, the reason I want to play with candidates, another reason I want to play with candidates, so I want to get this game out of the way. It's taken up far too much of my time here today, because I have played it, as I said, twice already and failed twice already.
All right, now I'll show you what I did before, but I, I still can't work out why it went wrong. <laughs> okay, so I have worked out, I believe, that the missing numbers are two, four, eight, and nine. There's no two, there's no four, there's no eight, there's no nine. Two, four, eight, nine here. So two, eight, nine in these squares mean that that is going to be a four. Okay, that's what I did. And the next thing that I did was uh, I said 2 and 9 block this square. So these squares have to be 2 and 9. And this has got to be 8. Because 2, 9 and 8 are missing. There's no 2, there's no 9, there's no 8 missing there. So that is indeed what I did last time. 8 blocking down here, 8 blocking across here gives us an 8 in this square. Uh, we get a pair of 8s here as well, since I am doing pencil marks now. And we've also got 8 somewhere across there. Now the next thing I said was 1 and 4 blocks down these two squares and 1 blocks across here. So I end up with a pair of 1 and 4 in these squares and end up with 5 and 7 in these squares. So far so good. It's still going as previously done. I don't know if that's so far so good or not because I, obviously I messed it up. It means that this can't be a 1 now. Let's get rid of the candidate 1. Uh, but 1 does block up here and 1 blocks across there so we end up with a pair of 1s in those squares there. Uh, right, let's just see if I can do any more candidates before I start messing around with this like I did last time. Okay, so what I said was we have 1 and 6 blocking this square and we have 1 and 6 blocking this square. So 1 and 6 can only be in those squares and I still believe that to be true. So I think that is correct. Uh, then I said, now that we know that's 1 or 6, we've got 5 across here. So 5 is in those squares and then 5 is going to be back here. But importantly, I said 7 across here. 7 is in one of those squares there. This can't be 7, and so this must be 7. What I didn't do at that last time was put digit 1 there because I didn't have a pencil mark to indicate that. But I think I got 1 here and 6 there. Or maybe I got those the wrong way around for some reason or another. I'm not sure. Anyway, that seems to be okay. Let's get rid of our candidate 1 up there now. And this is the only spot for a 1 in here now. And... Uh, okay. is up there nine across here and nine down here yeah that is what kind of what I did I think this turns out to be a two then so 9 is up here. Nine blocking up here, up here and across there for a 9 there. 9 across here and 9 across here and 9 up here. There's our 9. This must be a 9. This is not 9. Oh, 9 is finished.
two blocks this square. This is not what I did last time because I didn't have these candidates to make me so sure-footed. I am sure-footed now. Pencil marks make a big difference to me. Two blocking up here, two blocking down here. There's our two. I think I put that as a three last time for some reason. Somehow or another, I'm, I, I was doing a unique rectangle here with the fives and the sevens, and I calculated that as a three. I miss, I missed, messed it up. So three actually blocks up there. So we have threes in those squares and those squares. And the seven can go anywhere. I'll just put that seven in just for completeness over here. Uh, right, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was looking at this column. So three, four there. Two blocking across there gives us a pair of twos there. six up here so six in one of those squares there which means this can't be six that has to be six and that six can be removed seven blocking here and of course seven blocking those squares so that's the seven in that row after all uh, so we know that this is going to be oh sorry wrong Thing hit there. That's got to be a five. This will be our three. There's our seven. There's our five. Three, seven, six, and five. By the way, I was kind of this far in before it failed last time, so <laughs> I'm still not 100% confident. But yes, definitely something was different. I'm sure I put a three in this square here by mistake. At least the second time I did it. First time I made a different mistake, I think. Uh, I, what's missing from here? Four and seven, is it? Seven across there. I'll put the sevens there. This has got to be a four. Four up here and four across there puts fours into those squares and gives us four somewhere down there. This is not 7 or 8 and has got to be a 4. This can only be a 3 or a 2. In fact, we've got 3 blocking this square, so we know it is a 3. That's our 2. That's our 2 here. 2 across here, 2 across there, 2 down there. 2s are a pair there. three blocks across here that means three is in one of those squares blocking all the way down here there's our three three across here across there and down there so that's a pair of threes there the missing number to go here is four so this is the only four available in this row here's the four and that has to be a six six blocking up here up here there's the six this can't be a six. Six across here, six across there. That is our six. Get rid of those sixes there. Uh, eight blocks up here and across there. This is the only possible place for an eight. Three blocks across here, so that is definitely a three. And this must be, notice so I'm double checking everything because I just don't want to mess it up again. Four is in that square. Missing number here is eight, I believe. So eight there, seven there, seven there, three in that square, and get rid of the three there. Three blocking up here and across there. So this is our three. Five clearly here, two clearly there, two in that square there, and this is not. 
Uh, we've got just a one to complete this column. One blocking across here. Here's the one. Here's the four. Four across here. Here's the four. There's the five. Five back that way. This is the five. Eight finishes it successfully on a third attempt. And uh, I don't like playing Sudoku games more than once. I'll be honest with you. <laughs> Three times is definitely two times too many. Anyway, take care. Bye-bye.